Hey everybody, before we get started, I just remind you this episode is brought to our patrons like Adam Harp, Aka Comics, Architect 10, Black Star G, Carlos, Qua, Ferris, Jeremy Vasquez, Jonathan Sandoval, Kylie Denton, Legendary Boss Hunter, Liam Kessler, Regent Rapper, Rogue Robin, Sharvor, Shawnee P, Some Guy Named Bob, Soda Son of Super, and Cyber23. If you like what we do and want to see more, consider supporting us on Patreon. You get access to episodes early and lots of videos and helps us out. Thank you for support, everybody. Alright, I'm gonna try and make this draft bit go slightly faster. Uh and we're gonna open the five dark beginning, right? Five sealed draft. Gotta scroll up. Yep. Yeah. We're going to open that real fast before we get into any of the set descriptions, and I'll make it two separate bits so it goes faster. So let's open some stuff. Flip them. All right, Kamen Yadagarasu. Super rare Heavy Storm. I can only run one, unfortunately, because it's banned. Uh, I got a Common Gemini Elf. That's a good reprint. Got another Thunder Dragon, but I've got a full set. Uh, not super great, but not super bad either. Let's go ahead and open them. Maybe I can trade that Heavy Storm to somebody. Hey, I was just bitching about how I don't have a... S Fuck yeah! Oh my god! Super rare mirror force! Yes! The legend! The legend begins! Mirror force! Oh, oh, that was a bad match, but it was all worth it for the mirror force. Anyway, also, I can trade that uh, heavy storm to somebody, uh, but I'm not talking... I'm not trading that mirror force ever. Holy shit! Mirror force, guys! Mirror... Say hi, Betty, a mirror force! <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. Let's open another pack. I, wow, uh, some of these are broke. Uh, okay, so that's Thousand Dragon Common, Blade Fly Common, and I don't even know what this rare is. What is it? Oh, it's Royal Oppression. Okay, uh, that might be good to tech in. We got a Book of Tayo. That's good. I think I only own one of those. Got a Common Defusion. That's good. I think I traded my only one of those to those, and I think I got a full set of those. Okay. Let's keep opening and hoping they don't keep breaking. Okay, what do we get out of here? Royal Command. Ooh, my third bottomless. I got a Fiber Jar, but I already own one of those. Hoshiningen bottom. yeah. Nothing super great, but I do appreciate the third bottomless. And let's open that last pack. It doesn't matter what it is, because I got my uh, powerful, powerful man. Would you put you? Oh my god, it's Morphing Jar. Oh shit, dude. Oh my god. Oh, I love it. Holy shit. Uh, this is a pretty good uh, Dark Rev. I got Morphing Jar. Um, I don't think I'm going to play it because I think I'm going to pivot away from my Rock Stun deck. But we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. What's the haps? Um, yeah, fucking Morphing Jar. Sick. Uh, but I've got a Mirror Force and I've got uh, three Bottomless. So, yeah, that's cool. So I'm going to add Draft to Collection. All right, now I'm, I'm going to cut this part, but hopefully faster, read through the card set. So I'll see you then. All right, so this is the second half. Hopefully this will be faster. We're going to talk about the set and open some Cybernetic Revolution. This set's not super broke or anything, and it is only 60 cards. There's a couple of fun stuff introduced. You see Viacroids are in here. They're not super great. Wing Kribo level 10 exists. Mad Lobster might be funny for my water deck. You get all the Viacroids, though. They have uses, but are not super great, and some of them are not great, period. Um, there's not a lot of outright Elemental Hero stuff uh, support, but like Rock... Like, there's only one E-Hero in the set, but there is support like Rottweiler and, and um, Skyscraper later. Cyber Dragon is a big pull in this set. He's not guaranteed. He is a super rare, but he exists. So we should keep an eye out for him. And, you know, be how we be. Uh, there's also some other Cyber-style cards that are not super great, but they exist. we got stuff like Goblin Elite Attack Force now. Not the worst. BS Crystal Core. The BSs are funny. Some other machine stuff. The Lele Alien combo. Doitsu Soitsu. Introduction of frogs. I don't think you really want to play the frog deck uh, yet, but it exists. More batterymen. Some fusions. Steamroid. Unfortunately, you know, you've got... Look, look, Just look at the comparison here, guys. Ultra Rare, Power Bond. Ultra Rare, Cyber and Dragon. Ultra Rare, UFO Roid Fighter. Ugh. Uh, fusion Recovery, though, is a good staple. We will want some of those. Hopefully we can get some Miracle Fusions, because that's a pretty good effect. I definitely want Dragon's Mirrors, personally. Dragon's Mirrors is a great card for Fusion of Dragons. Uh, System Down will be a good tech card if we can find it, but it is a rare. Da -da 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 -da. Any others? There's some of that support I talked about. All right, yes, the Spiritual Arts are also a big deal. Um, staple common. And we want to keep an eye out for some more of these that are funny, but, uh, we'll see if we get any of them. So let's go to the Pack Simulator. Open Cyrev. Flip them. Um, Spark Blaster. Pretty typical. Uh, we got a couple of spiritual arts, though. Not the worst. 
Mm, okay, Miracle Fusion. Nice spiritual art. I will want Miracle Fusion eventually. Dimension Wall is one of those uh, generic tech cards I'm not super not super bad. It means that uh, if my opponent declares an attack, they take the battle damage instead. It's... Uh, yeah, uh, it's kind of like Magic Cylinder, but not quite. So it's a good card. Uh, Drill Raid is also meta-relevant. Pack number four. Different Dimension Master. Don't know what he does. DDM. Turns, discard one spell, car, special summon, one of your... Ah, uh, that's very niche. And he's a one tribute. No, he's bad. Uh, did get another Drill Raid. Got my Dragon's Mirror. Want that. Another Dimension Wall. More Spiritual Arts. Magical Explosion. I think I can only play one of those. More Spiritual Arts. Building up a tech set. I want those Spiritual Arts for future shit. Fire Darts. Okay. Another Dragon's Mirror, though. Uh, that's an ultra I didn't want to see. It's UFO Roid Fighter. Did get a Fusion Recovery, though. Sorry, I was so... Crystal Core. Okay, not the Super Rare I wanted, but all right. Um, Sorry, I was so distracted by fucking UFO Road Fighter. I did actually get a fusion recovery as well, and I think that's all my dragon's mirrors. Hey, there he is, Cyber Dragon. Okay, all right. So this is we're we're almost halfway through. We did unfortunately get UFO Road Fighter, but I think with one Cyber Dragon, we've probably gotten a full play set of Dragon's Mirror. We got a Miracle Fusion earlier. This is pretty decent. Let's see how far we go. Uh, Transcendent Wings, not super useful to me, but we're getting more Spiritual Arts. Steam gyroid, uh huh. Okay, got a rock there, Okay, my fu my future's looking good for um for doing that thing for for e heroes. If only I had e heroes worth polying. Then again, you know, Axe did get UFO UFO roid. I think I might be able to trade it for him to do something funny. Oh, hey, there's a good set. Okay, so that's another miracle fusion, and that's a skyscraper. God, if only I had the E-Hero monsters to go with it. I can't build this deck yet, but I'm going to love it when I can. Uh, Fusion Recovery. Ooh, did get System Down, though. That's a good one. It's a good card to consider. System Down. Okay, keep going. We're getting a lot of Vehicroids who are not very useful for me because I don't think I'm going to... Okay, well, there's another System Down. Definitely got, I think, enough of my Spiritual Arts as well. Uh, Generosity? Sorry, I'm just like, I realized, wait, the rare's on the very end. Got a third system down, though. Okay, so we have a playset of those if we're concerned about... If we're concerned about machine decks in the future. Another magical explosion. Don't think I can use that. Uh, pretty normal shit, though. Oh, baby! That's a good ultra. Power Bond. Fusion summon a machine fusion monster using monster's hand or field. Gains attack yields... Uh, damage equal to the on attack gained. So that's good for OTKs, but can still be powerful. I don't think I have any good machine fusion monsters, but power bond, maybe. I'm going to hold on to it. Other than that, I could power bond Steamroid, but I'm not going to. Okay. Now, Catapulter. Board Dragon's Mirror. Another Dark Catapulter. Yay, Spark Blaster. Yeah, I don't think there's much I can say about these. <clears throat> okay. All right. Okay. So um, that's my playset of fucking Miracle Fusion and another goddamn Power Bond. What the fuck? Well, those are... I'm holding on to those. Those are going to be good at some point, even if I don't got the juice for them. That's going to be a thing later. Holy shit. Last pack. It was... Nothing? Yeah, nothing really good. Um, okay, holy shit, all right. Well, we definitely got all the shit we wanted out of that. I mean, I would have liked more than one Cyber Dragon. Marth said he pulled three. Uh, but this is where we are. It's where we are right now. Uh, yeah, okay, so I'm going to add that draft to my fucking collection. I could say fuck, right? How long has this been? About six minutes, okay. Uh, and I will save the picture, and I will uh, get to the deck build. I don't know if you're going to see a lot of these cards in there yet. Um, to me, it's really a choice of whether or not I want to, uh, play my ro my dumb rock deck again, my dumb mega rock dragon, and actually make it better, or if I want to, uh, maybe go back to ocean, uh, or do something completely different. But, uh, we'll, we'll see based on what I got going on. All right, I will talk to y'all later after the deck build. Okay, recording. I immediately feel like I have to cough, but I'll try not to do that.
Hi, this is the deck build for this week. So, <clears throat> there you go, cleared my throat. We're going back to an old favorite, a new version on an old favorite. I've been kind of experimenting with some stuff off and on for the past couple of weeks. I've got some good representation, but also, you know, I don't really know if I want to trot out my ocean deck or my rock deck again, even with some new tech cards I've picked up. So I decided I think it was about the right time to cycle back to a deck I just enjoy playing. I've had a lot of fun testing this one. And so we're going back to my dragon deck. Notice there's no set. I can't guarantee the consistency of light and darks, even though I do have uh, a red eyes package and element and mirage dragon. Just it's, it's a little too slow to guarantee, and I don't actually want any of my darks in my grave. Uh, unless I'm activating them. But here we go. So, one red eyes, that's key for Darkness Dragon. Why, yes, have I only ever in once in testing actually summoned Darkness Dragon? Correct. But when did I do it? Did it have 5,900 attack? Yes. So, it's very rare, but I want that in there. Uh, we've got three Dragon Dwelling in the cave. It's a wall. It's a big defensive wall. I can set it to avoid face-up attacks and move on and pass. That's all our normal monsters. Obviously, we've got Red-Eyes Darkness. He's not that good, but if if we go for a long enough game that I can normal or special Black Dragon, I can go to Darkness, and you can be quite big. We, are, we have traded for the full Horus line. We're running two level fours, one level six, and one level eight. If we can go all the way through that progression, very fast. Still running Jinzo, the best Dragon maid. He's just one of my spicy lockdown cards who is still legal. Obviously, level six ignores spell effects. Horus is a is a optional spell negate. Great. We did get a Sidra. Sidra is now in the field. This is a great card to get when we have our our board has been blown up or uh, we're going second. You know, good crackback. Triple Mirage Dragon. It's basically pitchback Warwolf, but a dragon and light. It's a really good card to shut down the battle phases as a baby Jinsler. Uh, running only two element dragon, I do own three, but I decided to cut it down to two because we're not trying to make a said work. It's a funny card to get off, like if we troop dragon. Yeah, we're still running troop dragon. The ability to cycle through my deck and hopefully get out fodder for tributes. I have a lot of one tribute monsters. Uh, like technically I could hard summon Cy Cydra, I could do Horus, Jinzo. You know, hell, uh, building up another tribute so I can go into red eyes is very strong, so Troop Dragon, very important to the strategy. I want to get my one Tributes out. Uh, but Element is funny with that, but it's not necessary. You can still do some interesting beats, though, but that's where we are. Uh, double Mass Dragon, I only own two. If I had three, I'd run three. I should see if anybody has any spares, but here we are. Mass Dragon, it's good. It's, you know, it's a recruiter, but for dragons. Uh, and it lets me do some variable options, like I can Mass Dragon, Mass Dragon into Troop Dragon series to keep myself alive if I need to. Uh, or if, you know, my opponent's out of attacks, I can, on the crackback, set up my single Black Dragon's Chick. I do actually own, like, a full playset of these, but when you only have one Red Eyes and one Darkness, it's not really worth it. Still running one Magical Scientist for tech. We have access to Fiend Skull. Uh, Jama King doesn't really work without, like, a Metamorph or something or an Instant Fusion, but, like, he's... He's playable. I can do some funny stuffs. Mostly it's Dark Blade and Fiend Skull Dragon, but we got like Sandwich in here and some other crap. Uh, the spell package Raigeki, Feather Duster, Upstart, Scapegoats, all the normal shit. Then we're running our specialist stuff. Soul Exchange, obviously, again, have, you know, very key monsters. If I can removal into them and set up the stuff, very important. I added back in Monster Reincarnation. I dropped in the Element Dragons for this. As I said before, I don't actually really want some of these cards in my graveyard. So, discarding a spell or trap I don't need, or even a monster I don't need to get back one of my big boys. Very good. Two stamping. Uh, I could go either way on this, but three, but I feel like three is a little too clunky. I still have to have, like, a face-up dragon controlled to do it. One book. I own all three, but I'm not ready to run three book. I am running two my body. Again, I have a lot of big boss monsters who are not fully protected, so having a my body in the back pocket for... If somebody tries to sack Horus, or if somebody tries to Fisher or Smashing Ground Jinzo. Very important. Scapegoat, obviously, I mentioned before. Uh, I thought about United We Stand, but I'm going with Amplifier for this one. The ability to also use my trap cards when Jinzo is on the field is very important, because I now have triple Bottomless. I have added Mirror Force. I have triple Sack. Uh, so I'm running, you know, the Summon Package and the Battle Trap Package. Uh, there's no Pot of Greed anymore, so I'm running my one copy of Jar of Greed. It's slow, it's only one card, but... 
Draw power is draw power, and you know, I want to be able to burn through this deck a little bit. And I'm running two Magic Drain. Three Magic Drain is still a little clunky, but now that Cursed Seal is banned, there's no reason not to run Magic Drain. And as I said, my extra deck package is pretty the same. You're going to see that pretty commonly through all this. So that's my deck. I hope to have some fun, at least, you know, summon some dragons, and we'll see where it goes. I will see you in the bracket. Okay, let's talk about that bracket today, folks. So, David obviously had to take a pass last week, so I've decided to give him the bye this week. He's not in the first round. He gets a chance to recover, look at the format, see what people are doing, think about his life, and move on. And then, in all our first rounds, we've got a lot of classic matchups for you. So, in our first match, it'll be me back at the stands versus Vesper. One will rise, one will fall. We will see if Vesper is doing Shineball Beats again, and if I can defeat it. Probably not. We won't do Mystic Shineball Turbo. You've obviously just seen the deck I've pulled. But this should be a fun one. Uh, Vesper and I are both not the best, but very well placed in the format. But usually I have bad luck versus Vesper, so we'll see if I'm cursed. It'll be a fun one no matter what. You'll get to see some real Yu-Gi-Oh! And if that, you know, turns out to be ironic, then it was ironic. In our next match, it's time for Dallas versus Axe. I don't know whether Axe is Dallas's Kryptonite or Dallas is Axe's Kryptonite, but Axe riding high after another champ win. He'll have to get his full slugfest in versus Dallas, who will be doing something. I don't even think Dallas knows. Like, literally, the man rolls dice and decides what deck he wants to play when he plays. So, like... He, he is the truly random player. Uh, well, we're in GX, so I guess that makes him... Uh, makes him uh, what's his face? Was it Bastion? He can't play Water Dragon yet, though. That's next set. Axe obviously had a very strong light strategy last time for just pretty simple light beats. Uh, but I know he's been talking about wanting to do light and or machines stuff. So we'll see what goes on there. Because, I mean, he is part of that Cyber Dragon gang. There is, a, there is a multiple Cyber Dragons gang, I don't know if you know, and they're out there. They're represented in all all corners of the bracket. But in our last match, Luck gets a break. He doesn't go, go first. He gets to try out whatever monstrosity he's brewed up. I've been doing some test games with him, uh, which is fortuitous because we're on opposite sides of the bracket. But uh, um, he, he's, he's doing some interesting things. I hope he at least scores a win in. Um, if not, makes it all the way to the end, because, like, I, I want to let him flex this deck a little bit if he's doing that one. Or if he decides to go with something else, I'm sure it'll be fun. Marth, of course, is testing multiple decks. He may return to Zombie. But you never know. He also scored really big on the Cyber Dragon gang scheme, so we could see him try and flex those muscles a little bit. Uh, but no matter what, it'll be pretty interesting to see how this all shakes out. And that's the breaks, folks. I will see you guys for the matches. Take it away, future me. Button right then. So now we're going. The ticker is ticking. Hello, I don't have a good GX pun this week. Something about Cyber Dragon and cage matches. Yeah, well, okay. I mean, we're just going to rehash we're the format today. With the food in the Discord. Uh, I'm going to throw no. you face down into the graveyard. I don't know. I mean, well, that's what's going to happen to me because I'm that. facing Vespair. And while I, we had a very funny, not even, I don't even know if we'd call it, a test game, but oh, we, we did a thing. We played each other with, 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 our, with our with our jank ass e hero builds. We played we Gen One e heroes against each other, uh, uh, but I, I know some of that tech might actually make it into your final product deck. I don't says I don't know what you're doing, but um, in case anybody doesn't know, uh, we're both pretty good players in this format. I think I'm still number two, and Vesper is number three. Yeah, in I, terms I, of wins. I, I, I've become the fifty percent mostly because I constantly do weird ass shit and my and my early curse from not playing fire. Yeah, but I have terrible on screen luck against you. If anybody's watched any of our Yu Gi Oh content, period. So this is gonna be funny. Let's go to RPS. All right. Okay. Hmm. The mind no. games of our Damn. RPS off the top. Pass me the rock. Oh, shit. I mean, what? it's a game. Oh, it's a match. I actually, I actually don't know. Oh, well, yeah. So, sadly, no breakfast but a chicken curry for me. I'm just going to get some ah, fucking well, McDonald's. I guess we'll just ban this card right off. All right. Well, somebody, somebody's going to, yeah. We're going to yeah. Graceful Charity turn one. Yeah. yeah right. Ego. Right. I forgot. Yeah. Graceful yeah. Charity was a rare in Dark Beginnings 1. David, you can't ban this week. And a I mean, bunch I of people go. That card uh, is uh, getting banned this week. Hold on, Axe. Yeah. If no one else bans it, I will assuredly ban it because I feel like I might lose the luck to Marth. 
Uh, well, we'll have yeah, to see. Uh, okay, what did we get rid of? Giant Trunade. Charity? No, it was Trunade. No. Oh. Okay, sorry. That it's was the graceful actual graceful, and... but we graceful into upstart, which is hilarious. And then we're running captain. Oh. It's time for warrior toolbox. Luckily, this yeah, is no. turn one, so I get to destroy whatever board state appears. This is the one week that we're all going to uh, that that graceful charity is going to be playable. I'm never going to I actually have an, I actually have a spare run of captain. Fuck. Wow, that's a um, that is an opening hand you have. Okay, there. all right. So I will say it. I'll say it right I'm now. probably gonna die immediately because you've said everything, which I don't like. But ironically, this is the fastest graceful. Uh, this is the uh, fairest graceful charity will ever be. Uh, probably because you know what releases next set and will make graceful charity horribly busted. Dark World. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, Dark cool. Worlds. Dar it's uh, it's cool. Graceful Charities like Dark World Lightning, but better. <laughs> or not Dark World Lightning, Dark World Dealings. Is why did Dark I ever? Why did I never think about that ever? Like, fuck, I'm dumb. I'm gonna die. No, I never what, considered that. That's Dark World Dealings. I guess it's because I've never seen. It's never talked about. I got a ban. I got like a ban because uh, I didn't die. Holy shit. Is uh is Dark World Dealings getting banned? Probably not. No, it's a one think. for one. Your opponent gets to draw as well. Yeah. Why would it get banned, David? <laughs> Dark World Dealings isn't overpowered. The only card that I think will get banned out of Dark World... Um... Okay. You can take I mean, my Magic Drain. That's not... not that no! Magic Drain doesn't matter when I'm playing Horus level 6. Oh, actually, that, yeah, that's right. Hey, you Wait, know what? Pot of Greed may be banned, but you know what's not? <laughs> yes, Jar let's go! Well, I've tried running Jar of Greed in the back of the day. Jar of Greed! Great. That was an interesting thing to pull off the top with Jar. The people at home know. Also, Axe is super loud. He's trying not to be quiet this time. Hold on, I need to adjust him down a little. It's a thing Axe has bought his megaphone today. No, it's more just like he's actually on his microphone. Uh, instead of I, I mean, around. I up my game by like 10 decibels, so I got him. So you said Jar of Avarice is next set, right? Uh, no, Pot. Pot of, pot of Avarice. Oh, pot. Pot, of pot is uh, select five monsters in your graveyard, shuffle them back into your deck, draw two cards. So it's mm -hmm. not the best, but it's graveyard recursion. And I yeah. got to be honest, guys, with as sacky as this format is, if you guys start keep hitting graveyard stuff, I might have to start punching people at this point. We're 15 weeks in. Also, like, it's great for life support. I mean, right. I'm sure it's great for a multitude uh, of uh, decks. Omega, but... I'll tell you, there's a big reason I keep hitting graveyard stuff. I have absolutely none of it. Well, hopefully you can get some. Yeah, All right, uh, so... I'm sorry. We need to, we need to Not stop having graveyard recursion while other people have hey. graveyard recursion is... That sucks. Well, that's a good time to uh, activate that, because I cannot negate it. As soon as it leaves the field, scapegoat. Well, it's because I haven't actually summoned him to negate it yet. So, yeah, here yeah. we go. It was in your hand, damn. Yeah, I, I drew it off the, the jar. So now we're in an interesting place. I have actually summoned Horus the Black Flame Dragon level 8. You have. Kind of terrifying. It's a good... Which means I now have an optional negate spell traps infinitely. Or spells infinitely. I keep saying spell traps because I say them as one, but no, spells, yeah. yeah it's good. You're, basically, your opponent doesn't get to play spell cards. <laughs> Sorry, I know this has nothing to do with what's happening, but for a moment there, it looked like my Uber driver was sideways driving up a road, which looked very confusing. Deja vu! <laughs> <laughs> like, the car is horizontal, slowly sliding up the road. I'm yeah. like, Wait you, you think that's just an error, but really, your driver is actually in one of those movies. <laughs> so, what, the next that is elemental energy? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So you're all in the schedule. It's, uh, it's a... Uh, so... Pot of Avarice is a secret slash old, uh, secret rare, super rare slash. Old it's an SR, player. it's a super rare. That's not actually that bad. That's yeah. the same as Cyber Dragon, of which some of you people own three. Well, some of you people have Mirror Force. That All was right. a super in the thing, oh, wait, and don't you go comparing the two. It is compared uh, to me. Axe, once again, I'd like to get upset because of what <laughs> you say. Uh, Miss, as I am Mr. Gotten, Drew, no Cyber Dragons, Drew, no, uh, Mirror Force. Yeah, also, I, I believe I'm. This is just, you can do it. Yeah, no, I know. No, it's no, not no, once no. per turn. It's really annoying. You just can't play, ma play I spell cards. I, I don't want you to do. What happens is I lose. You need, to, you need to find a Saku or something. 
So, fun fact, Chorus was in a, a tournament deck two years ago. That's I how mean, relevant it's still, it's, yeah, it's, it's, still good. it's still good. Yeah. It has dead my dads too. If you have oh, a yeah. dragon in. This episode will be coming to you a day later, but welcome to April 1st. Oh, Jesus oh, well, fucking Christ. I'm gonna hate tomorrow. I hate Luckily, it's not actually April April Fools. Well, yeah, for you guys, for me it is. <laughs> we don't talk to you, future seer. I am I, I'm from London. the future. Dallas, I'd like to preemptively apologize in case Vesper decides that Taurus level 8 is too spicy. Uh, no, well, I'm, I'm going to ban level 6, so that way you just can't play 8. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. That's, oh, that's, that's, uh, that's devilry. I, I will tell you. you Immediately gets undone. Okay. But things were uh, No, <laughs> that's we decided just... you can't do that. Any any bans I mean, I thought, this I thought week we'd do that are... Like penis. Well, no, it's bans for the last two. We decided that last time. The last two weeks' bans are in effect. Well, I don't actually think we said last two weeks. Last two weeks. No, was. no, <laughs> never been said. Roll the tape. Uh, I will literally I roll the tape. I, I think mostly it was us going. It's been recently banned. We probably shouldn't unban it. Available appears. Yes, it's a pick and uh, card. Did, also, I did I roll the tape. Uh, Chaos ruler or Chaos uh, ruler got banned uh, two time, uh, two episodes before we did the unbanning, and people said it was too recent. I mean, just because it's too recent, that doesn't mean it's actually prohibited. If there was a discussion, there was a discussion. That's that different from, hard. you cannot. I believe we actually said the first time we did it, you can't unban something that was just banned. Yeah. That's different yeah. from, like, this card just got banned, I don't think the format's changed enough for us to let this out. No, that's spo spoilers, there's some still some cards from the last five weeks that I still think some of them might be a little too soon. Yeah. We're going to have to have oh, that by the discussion. Way, Dallas, it's been, it's been enough time we can unban uh, like our favorite card. I don't no, want to pre-discuss it too much. Then. These people at home are already way. possibly going to have to sit through a lot of it. No, yeah. true. We'll, 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 yeah. we'll, we'll see what happens. Go. Don't worry, uh, my mouth will be full of burgers eventually, so I'll shut the fuck up. Yeah, I mean, I, mean, I swear to God, if we go through this week and no one bans Bristol Charity, I'm gonna stab someone. <laughs> you do it yourself. Dallas well, takes the I... dive specifically to scrap. I mean, just, I mean just, oh, just, just, Dallas will help you with cheese, bro. Dallas, I'm tem honestly, I'm man. tempted. <laughs> well, we'll have to see how your matches go. But I'm also against Axe, so I don't wanna. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just stuck oh. forever as being. The, the, the motivation. I've said you are the Roman Reigns of our group. <laughs> I'm just the motivation for everyone to be. Well, you're the top, and you constantly bitch about everything. So we have to destroy you. I, it, 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 we I we have to make your top. your your conversation the same level as your win rate. So either you need to start <laughs> talking like a winner, or we need to make you a loser. <laughs> well, make me feel like a winner for once. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, Next, mm, you constantly complain mm. even when you win. So why would we? Yeah. Yeah. I've got the perfect thing for Axe right here. <laughs> no, it's all those <laughs> secrets, mister. I'm the only one who owns two magic cylinders. <sighs> I got a better one. Uh oh, he's typing it. He's not even going to say it. And not oh, yeah. Dragon, that's oh, no, it's a song. <laughs> oh, he's going to. He's, he's, he's linking something at home. It's, is that everybody, everybody Loves Me? The song you posted on your phone? That's my song. Pull a card. I mean, oh, like I need to mark his red. This is Axe. <laughs> <laughs> How could this happen to me? It's really dumb. All right, well, Wait, uh, if win. it's a sack, we'll have to have a real game of Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, who but... did you think it was? I mean, I, I have a card and wrote it in my hand, so mm. I can do nothing. Can All right, well, then it? I will win yeah. with my full-ass back row. Yeah. Wait, who did you think of? How did this happen to me? How could this happen to me with my... It was uh, some asshole who won Australian Idol like a while ago, who originally done the song. <laughs> All right, that's the match. Either that was a cover. I I probably should have said that funny line after I hit the button, but now we're recording and you guys are both here, so let's go. Okay, so that's uh, oh, that's Axe, I believe, is going first right now. He's on the bottom. He's so island. to to date this to date this uh, video horribly, uh, there there was a there's a new new map on uh, Among Us. Yes, this is happy day before April Fool. Wow, fuck. Okay, 
Damn, yeah. the rips. I mean, it's it's that was a good top my... deck. Oh, you are also playing this. Well, Dallas, yeah, I hope uh, we beat in the finals, buddy. Uh, okay, well, now my heart's already broken. Uh, this is going to be an interesting one. Heavy Storm, legal. Uh, and depending yeah. on what he fishes out, no, he's just going to farm it up. I mean, I kind of know. I kind of think I know what I'm going to ban now for certain. <laughs> uh, I mean, now that I know Dallas at least is playing this and he's progressing the line, I feel less bad. Okay. So, I like, I was happy with my banning level 6, but it's the one I would ban, because... Well, I mean, it definitely debones the whole Horus line for probably five yeah, weeks. you can't summon 8 without 6. It is just the way it's worded. Yeah. yeah. So 6 is the card to ban in the, in the line. I thought... I, mm, if you want to get rid of all of them, I, I still kind of lean towards... Six is annoying, but not the worst team. Well, like 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 Vesper is saying, if you get six, you literally can't play eight. You cannot play eight yeah. because it can only yeah. be summoned by six's effect. Period. Yeah. Um. I I was now I, like yeah, obviously I do think that like six is a much more fair card, like because it's only yeah. got twenty three hundred attack. You can out it with, um, trap still, and trap it doesn't con. negate spells, so you can still play other cards. Yeah. Uh, like, just now, Axe beat it by doing the thing. Well, now's the other thing that could get banned, maybe. I crashed into it, but yeah. I mean, you crashed, but you managed to equal its attack points, so it worked out before he could yeah, actually yeah. do the thing. I was just worried he was going to Magic Drain, because everyone fucking plays Magic Drain somewhere else. Well, we can't play Cursed Seal anymore. We have to play Magic Drain, because we don't all own Magic Jammer, bougie Axe. I'm not running that. <laughs> well, you should be, you bougie fuck. <laughs> Run your good uh... cards. I want to say I might, I might have a magic train in my deck. I don't think I ever use it because I never draw it. But I think I've magic train, I believe, magic. was a rare in a set, if not a common, and everybody should own a couple. I think we all went I out had, decently. I think I have one at least. Well, yeah, I mean, like, why do you if never have any? Rare, I mean, uh, I've talked about this before. I got, I only own one Gaga, uh, Gaga Gigo, who is a common. Ooh, uh, throughout the Jinzo. Yeah. Interesting. So it's he either thinks he can't play Jin's, Jinzo right now, or he's got like Premie. Does oh, he have well, Prem? You can play Premature Burial well, in this format. Th think of the setup: Jinzo and uh, Horus at the same time. Uh, as a guy who also definitely owns a Jinzo, and uh, when we played against each other early, earlier, Dallas was like, "Oh gosh, I should put Jinzo in this deck." No, yeah. Welcome to us, guys. Me and Dallas are basically playing kind of sort of the same deck, I think. Well, uh, I throw out Jinzo for a specific reason. We'll get into that later. Oh, yeah, well, now I'll you're going to see the specific reason. I had better, Jinzo. <laughs> Kinda, yeah. Yeah. At least it's a, it's a Jinzo you <clears throat> don't need to worry about uh, summoning, tributing. Also, holy shit, Axe has an MST. Yeah, I don't know mm -hmm. where, where Axe got an MST. Right. Was it the Dark reprint? Beginnings one. Okay, when it became a super. Mm -hmm. Still yeah, very spicy. So Dallas is gonna ban MST, of course, and then I will ban mm. Horus. Oh no, no, no! If you uh, ban Horus, because you're going first, if you're banning anyway. Horus, I will ban Harper. Oh, Horus. and there he is, the first one of the night. <laughs> I wasted this. Why part. are you being a cunt about it? Uh, because this is my favorite card in Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay, yeah. all right, like. Oh, no, I'm being petty. I realize. Mm. I don't really want to have this argument on air. Um, I don't want any pettiness, so I don't know if I've got to like throw my dick down and be like, "No, fuck it. I will executive orders. I will. I will yeet both of your bands in that case. I'll just be I'll like, no bands this week. Fuck you. Producer. I will be the ultimate petty man. What's going on now? Fuck. Dallas uh, said because Vesper goes first eight. that uh, if Vesper bans level eight, who is a or level six, I guess technically. But realistically, I will probably still ban uh, But I have to say Harpy's Feather Duster now because it's a meme. <laughs> See, but here, I don't know. I get if, messages if... about it. It's fucking. Well, I've lost Wait, you get messages false. about it? Yes! Also, though, that said, that is actually hilarious because, by the way, Dallas opened this with a picture perfect heavy storm. Yeah. People at home. Don't yell at Dallas about Harpy's Feather Nester, unless he does it tonight, in which case, Dallas asked for it. Yo, no, no. If, if Dallas like actually plays to the meme, let him have it. Here's the thing. I could not, in good conscience, if I lost this, I could not uh, ban anything other than racial charity. Uh, because I've said before, it is the strongest card in all of you. 
It's so pretty bullshit. I'd rather play just... Horus level 6. What I've just imagined is Dallas is like, oh, this is my gimmick, I guess. Like, the gimmick no, was yeah, no, that is No, yeah, no, that is me at this point. It's like, it, I, right, this is my thing. I think that's... But, I mean, I don't, like... I mean, if I if I could, I'd love to talk Vesper down to just level eight because that's actually the negate forever. I can't even play anything in my hand. Because but but that's a thing we can talk about uh, in the later. Band yes, when it happens. But that said, Vesper has a has a very valid point now. Now there are two Horus Dragon decks in the meta, and Dallas has way too many Horuses. I only own one of each. Well, yeah, no, this is about to get uh, cruel. I oh my God! Yeah, According to that's right, he okay. has two level eights, uh, doesn't he? According you know. to my Uber like, Eats map, my, my, means nothing. <laughs> my driver is teleporting every few seconds. Yeah, welcome to welcome to Horus Lock. Welcome to Horus Lockdown, Jax. Uh, Hi. You can't <laughs> play spell cards. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You really can't In this case, cards. Vesper, you might not even have to do anything. Mm. Ooh. That's a I monster effect. The monster effect. Really Is that so once per turn? Yeah, he's got so the lights. Turn, he can get at least yeah. one. Happen. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, uh, it's already over. I have a smashing ground and Regeki in my hand. Doesn't mean nothing. Yeah. This, this was not the deck to play that against. Yep. Ooh. There we go. I didn't know what you were playing. No, you didn't. I didn't know what I was. Say right the fuck now. We're going. Hi. I want you to acknowledge that you're real and not just a robot. That said, your text uh... is is <laughs> your text is captured. Bluff is eating. I think we're. Are we down a spectator? Uh, no, we got five. Uh, okay. count five spectators, Not... two in game. Okay, all right, we're good. When I say it, trust me. So we're we're gonna go to RPS. Loth may not be very talky, which will be a shame because I love his deck. Ah, fuck! You love his deck? Well, yeah, I've yes, seen no, it. Come on. No, start you have the to... fan fiction. That's too much effort. <laughs> Uh, who's going first? Martha's going first. Yeah, he he is yeah, on yeah, the bottom yeah, here as red player. Anyway. <laughs> he has begun immediately with terraforming into Mystic Plus. Hmm. Immediately playing a good card. Darkness. Yes, he's playing the Mad Dog of Darkness. I'm you, still you annoyed no there's no light in 1900. Light, uh, light. You're annoyed there's no light in 1900. Yeah. Axe, there's no such thing as a water 1900 ever. It or doesn't a fire exist. 1900. Or an Earth 1900. No, there's. I'm pretty sure there's a fire 1900. Not yet. Yeah. No, but like I'm. I literally searched the entire card database. There doesn't exist a card of of water that is 1900 attack exactly. Or 2000. Hmm. I, no period. I see that Loth is. Uh... Yeah, Loth is doing some tricks here. He's doing Loth his uh, underworld. Deck. Draw. Oh. I want. I. I just need to see if it exactly implodes. Now, unfortunately, Loth really needs an MST because that Mystic Plasma Zone really does. Yep. Okay. Uh, Start the chain. Wow. How rude. That does it. Yeah, it's a continuous effect. <laughs> it needs to be face up to resolve. How rude. Fuck. That is actually just like. So, I think this is the only time the phrase that banning Regeki Break has been legitimate. Like, that was just act- that was literally like it, punching it, a guy. <laughs> it could definitely happen. Well, also, this deck, if it's what I think it is, is possible to turn one win. Oh, but he's Spear Cretined. I, I mean, te it's technically it's possible, win. it's not- it's not gonna happen, though. No, it's not likely, but it is possible to turn one win. Well, it's not like, turn- not literally turn one, because you- you have to activate it, and you can only no, do it when you- open. You can only do, you can only do, um, Heart of the Underdog when your draw phase happens. No, you can open all five pieces of Exodia. Well, okay, that part, but that's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. Okay, he's gonna Tribute Set, that will in fact so, get over. There's, there's one monster that could be in if Mark looks without monster. There's nope, there's, there's a couple, there's one in the card there's bank as two. well. God, that works, son of a bitch. Wow, Martha's just that is beats. that is a big dog. Is that going to get over the Neo Aquamundo? That definitely is. No, of his shield. Yeah, no, it's the same monster. It's the same monster. I mean, it's the same monster as well. Well, no, the the other one it could have been was Guardian. Is Guardian have three thousand attack too? Man, I know this was off mic, but remember no. when Moff said he was waiting for me? Yeah, it's like Marv, you could have knocked him with the dick. No, don't. Well, I mean, he's playing a win, but it's opponent. definitely yeah. like just yeah. like he's got every single thing for this deck. Yeah. Mm. 
Marco's the weirdest luck because he kicked my ass so many times. <laughs> I need to look up how many times Axe has gotten his ass kicked and see if the number rates up to how many times Axe thinks he's gotten his ass kicked. It's not, uh, spoiler, it's not. Test games with Marv, he's always beat. Okay, test games. No, now Marv is officially just styling on Marv, I would like explanation. Now he's just styling. He's just summoned the Skull Servant. You know what you need to do? You need to ban Skull Servant. A bent king. I mean that would be that would be the most pettiest, but also well, would be very Mystic legit. Pla Mis ban Mystic Plasma Zone. <laughs> don't ban Malevolent Nuzzler because that's the that. one that allowed. I mean no, Mystic Plasma. Some... It's in terms there's of like what was meta relevant that absolutely fucked over Loth. It's Raigeki Break or Plasma Zone. Like you can ban Malevolent Nuzzler, but there's like five million equip spells that do the same damn thing. Yeah. Uh, Let's start the recording. <laughs> We're, right. we're live. All right. Uh, we're all here. Let's go to RPS. Well, we're just going to immediately get out. Yeah. This is a hand. <laughs> it was legitimately just be like... Axe, it's it's okay. Move past it. Shut up. Let it, let it die. We understand you, Axe. No further clarification is required. Uh, hey, audience at home, I'm the red player on the bottom. You can see what cards I have, so you know which one is me. David is currently going first. He has set two cards. He will pass. Right. Okay. Let's start with Upstart. Okay, I have no idea what he's playing. And it's entirely possible. Ah, gosh, no, yeah, I think it's the safer play. I'll go for Mirage. No battle traps. Into that, uh, scapegoat. Okay, he's gonna search with tomato. Right, it marks the lunch. Keep that with it. Tomato into witch. Okay, cool. Gonna go to main phase two. Going to set a card and pass. Why does he's, it suddenly feel like we're playing a golf right now? Like, no, like, no, yeah, he's, it, it's, he's it's, thinking it's about something really hard. Sorry, yeah, I was no. In the world, boss. That's, uh, yeah, that's, that's not what I was expecting. We could do everything. I in... swear to God, if we start doing, don't make me bring out my I, ASMR voice. I would rather hear Barf do golf talk, golf talk, because that's what I need to try. <laughs> no, Dallas, no, please. I don't like that background. All right, I guess I'm from you. Uh, well, ooh, magic drain on the stamping. Well, I mean, I don't have anything, so it'll just negate. The job. I mean, he doesn't lose 500 life points. That's technically a win. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like it's, 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 it's just him being like, well, why not? So I could have gotten this started a whole turn earlier, but you know, here's where we are. I played it safe. I am, in fact, trying to win. All right, what's he gonna search, and is it gonna be a pain in my deck? I mean. There's a couple. Yeah. Come on, David. There's a couple. Yeah. Yeah. No, that 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 is the card. I was like, is it gonna be Exile Force or gonna be a Warrior Lady? All right. Uh, well, hey guys, guess what's optional? Have a Warrior Lady. I'm not gonna do it. He's got Exile Force. Lovely horse is yeah. optional. And I own two level fours. You know this from previous weeks, and I have not traded. <gasps> He's gonna Rota? Rota. He's gonna is he also playing? Is he also playing? No, he's gonna free. Uh, That's not no, it's just super relevant right now. A lot, of, a lot of decent light targets are warriors. Okay. I mean, in like, general, like, warriors are bottomless. Good card. No, it's not bottomless. Okay. Uh, free can't be used. Free can't be used, but Freed can uh, just hit over. Yeah. Yeah, free, free so he definitely set a battle trap just now. Ah. Uh. So, just had a or look at this. Apparently, Elizabeth Japan is in that new uh, April Fool's game. I don't think that's relevant at all, Loth. That thing you brought up in the middle of my Yu-Gi-Oh match. I am sorry. L look. To be fair, this is a fairly quiet. Activate rising yeah, energy. Yeah, no. It's... Yeah. As predicted. Okay. Yep. Well, so but I, it's I, I what I had to do. I do find it a bit sad that Rush recklessly just got power crept by Rising Energy. 
Did it right. get power crop though? Don't you need to like discard for cost for rising you need to or something? For rising energy. Rushcrop is still viable. It's just that no uh, one plays it. That okay. Much. Oh yeah. Something I need to say right now. That right, Geki breaks the same play I could play against uh, the spare. All those matches we go. Yeah. No. It's yeah, it's, it's, it's not hard. I don't. Break. Mm. I don't even know why that was necessary to say. I, I think Marth probably said it during the game, but he was muted, so mm -hmm. you guys remember he said it. Yeah. Which is fair. Yeah. Same play, I, I had to do it, so yeah. No, uh, despite uh, certain people being uh, emotive about it, you play to win. That's how you play. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's, I just don't... I always, I have a problem right there, but people don't get to actually show what their deck well, does. Then well, then they, that's, not, it's a tournament axe. Don't play card games. Don't, 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 I mean, don't. Part of, the, part of this tournament, or part of this format is really just so we can show what will be made. No. Yeah. yeah but, but, if, but, but, actually, if, also, no, it's not. This tournament is made to have fun opening see. cards, have fun playing cards, have fun winning. Oh, no, no, no point is this about showing off things. Uh, don't be Simo and purposely hold back your winning for YouTube revenue. Okay, we're just gonna go there. Well, we had a long discussion off. By the, off by the way, the, opi the opinions of Dallas Rose do not necessarily reflect on Studio Omega. <laughs> and, and and then add twelve minutes to the end of the video, so you don't know you get two votes. <laughs> okay, that's pretty hilarious. Uh, yes, with priority, I will activate Black Dragon Chick's effect. Priority. <laughs> priority. <laughs> hmm. Red Eyes Black Dragon's a pretty good card when you can check it. Yep. yep, and we'll get rid of that free, and yeah, let's just mill whatever's that out of your deck, because I'd much rather know that it's something you're going to put on the board than I know you're going to go into a witch search of some exiled force shit, because you can always just exile my poor red-eyes boy, but I got to I got to actually special him with Chick for the first time, like, ever on screen. So... I drew a card. Ooh. Hey, do you have another spell card in hand? Ooh. Ah. No, I do not. Ah. Magic Dream, baby! But that, uh, that, clears, that clears a few things out. Yes, indeed. I Sounds do have like... no I have no Barbacro. That was Magic Dream the whole time. Sounds Magic like a mega, a mega oh. plate of XX Saber Goddess. It is time what? to tribute one light and one dot. It's bad. Ooh. For Sid. Okay. Yeah. Sid's big. The effect, though. You already did something. No, but yeah. he, he, he is a 3k. No, he doesn't need to do the effect. He's this would be a really this would in here. fact be a really dumb time to do the effect because of how many life points I have over him. It's no, he's just gonna beat me up. To... Not to mention that Omega has no cards in hand, so you're doing it for like nothing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah no. This is no, a, no, this is this just is... he's gonna blow he's gonna beat up my entire field the old fashioned way. He's gonna slow Regeki me. And slow I'm gonna take some Regeki. damage and I'm gonna need a really good top deck. You're gonna need exactly right So I have a question. I don't know if David actually watches the progression series, but I'd like everybody's opinion. Is David gonna be the guy who still has said against Black Wings? I will set a card like pass. Two or three He's decks. Keeping it. <laughs> I I am working on two or three decks in the back. In I did. just haven't quite got so i mean i i cut said straight up out order. of my dragon deck even in though i have lights in and darks David's defense uh one of my decks is still a said deck i just well, didn't roll i i think to to be fair okay to that's gonna be game then if you are playing a dark and light deck play said if you aren't don't play said it's that well simple. that said why are you playing a light and dark deck if not to activate said yeah, yeah. Well, because that, light. That, well, that honestly, because light and dark is really good right now. I mean, they are, yeah. but like as an actual like light and dark deck. But yeah, no, that's the that's an OTK blowout. Yeah, I was just oh, talking yes. about this too. Yeah, that's what happens okay. when you draw so, dragon dwelling in a cave. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. That's, that's, good, good I'm match, so though. glad that I well I won my moral victory versus oh, Vesper, wait. but I'm so glad I eliminated Vesper from the format just to uh, run into set again. <laughs> Now we'll start the recording so I can reference to the people at home about a joke I made earlier in the thing that they heard, but you didn't hear the repeat now, just now. Uh, what we called Dallas Bastion. I'm so glad that, that Loth said that part off camera. Oh, wait. But Mark said a different thing on oh, camera. Oh, right. I remember that. Anyway, let's go to, let's go to RPS so Dallas can, no, uh, can no, do... No, no, he's not wrong. That was a sexy tiger. All right. Well, we're just now that you know the context. <laughs> I know the like a lady. 
If 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 they get it, they get it. If they don't, they'll be. Confused. Oh wow! I think I just we won. are in the GX time. Okay, so Marth is going first. He's uh, blue player on the top. Well, good luck, both of you. Because Marth, I, I believe you have won. I don't know. Well, we'll see what happens. Okay, well, you summon Dark Dog. If he plays Mystic, yeah. So you have just lost just because. It's already over. Yeah. This hand is, uh... Like, I would hate it if, like... Oh, I mean, on the one hand, I understand why Vesper is, like... Hold on, we're chaining something. He's thinking. He's gonna waste on my body. Is that a waste? Is it a waste if it outs everything in Dallas's deck? Well, I mean, is it was it just a, a single smashing ground. I know Dallas owns at least three of them. Is it a waste if that happens? Is it, is it a waste? It depends. When, you know... Now that you played no monsters, maybe it wasn't a waste because he gets to basically do yeah, as much sucks. damage and more. Oh, sorry. Oh, yes. Okay, never mind. He I he debated that. you. Yeah, so actually, that. yes, the my body was kind of a waste, but yeah. Dallas well, knew mean, that he going in. Created a my body for a Sakuretsu and oh, a Smashing okay. Ground. Okay. I mean, I yeah, game. but he still lost fifteen hundred life. It's yeah. a it's an interesting complex. We've had this conversation off mic about my body. It is actually really good if you're playing certain Saki like boss monsters that you really don't want to get blown up. But it's it's a card that's very risky to play because you never know when your opponent's gonna just. Do I'll some other Nudoria. outs. Yeah, Nudoria. Okay. That's ah. that's his version yeah, of Exiled Force. Marth always plays Nudoria. I my ass on well, well, this is my first time playing Nudoria, too. Nudoria is good. Yeah, no, it's like uh, Yogi Nudoria ship. Nudoria almost makes the cut in sometimes. I've, I've used it a while back, and sometimes I almost think about bringing it back. My well, body is one of those body. cards where it usually only kind of Raigeki or, or Saki Disruption against your boss monsters. Yeah. And Rakeki Rake is a one of, but there's a billion. There's a billion. Come out, Drago. It's weird. Nah. I I probably would Rake. have just set the Nudori and yeeted his horse. I would have done the same thing. Because he yeah, he, he, he can't level up. Well, I mean, yeah, you could compulse then, but still, like, he has to attack. Well, he has to attack you anyway, but he has to attack your monsters to get yeah. extra horses. Yep. Yeah. Dallas's Horus deck is very consistent at the Horus bit. <laughs> uh, I am running three second three, one. Two. Well, damn. Ah. Horus's weakness getting punched in the face. Fire yes, off. no, that is actually Horus level six's weakness. Is he is a small boy? If I <laughs> again, it's why if I had for, like for a level si for a level like... six monster with such a good effect, yes. Oh. Brain control. Yeah, if he has that monster, he might just win. Ultimate ultimate rare brain control. No, he's going to okay. tribute for another Horus. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, why would I not? Oh, unless. Yeah, no, that's well, there's first. that potential, but also, yeah. Yeah, Marvin with his three bottom. Book! And Torrential. Fair! All right. All right, he's going to go for everything. Go. Okay. Interesting wow. choice, but I cannot diss it. Uh, knowing my hand, that is probably a game winning choice. So. So Dallas is holding now. two level eights? Uh, no! But I might have, well, actually, technically yes, but also no. <laughs> oh, so he's holding a level up or something, probably. I'm holding a level 8 and a level 8 monster. Um, ah. Uh, ah. So there's... But, uh, yeah, I know. So there's a whole oh, thing with Garp. It's like, he just has so many, I think he has all the staples right now. Oh, <laughs> no, hey, Axe, you're just That's being right. a big confirmation bias baby. I should play 5 million games against Axe so he can bitch about my cards, because I don't care. I mean, I'll just tell Axe to retro, fuck off. Force, <laughs> no, uh, Omega, Omega, clearly you need to play Fiber Jar well, against Axe. I'm dead. Yeah, that's another... So, I don't know if this bit was actually on mic, but remember how earlier today I said we haven't had a lot remember of big how OTK was so turns? <laughs> well, this, uh, this, this, this is why we don't ban until after you get to see the whole format, because you might get some people who are very uh, sassy about getting blasted by Horus, but then they look at the format and go, oh, actually, yeah, um, Horus kind of sucks. Also, I yeah. will say this. I ran the... Yeah. This is my third... I'm going to start the recording. Uh, guys, uh, fair warning, we may be slightly pre-spiced because in the intervening, Axe posted his deck and was complaining about how blown out he got. And I was like, well, Axe, you're you're only I running did, five traps. I didn't mean to come up with blown out. But fair, okay, fair enough, I guess. But uh, you guys are both here. Let's do finals. This is a, this is a finals yeah. rematch, actually. Yep. Yeah, it's, uh, it's been a minute, match. hasn't it? Oh. Or... Okay. David is That's going first. He's blue on top. Anymore. Apparently, everyone has their day, except for Locke. 
Hey, Loth okay. will have his game. Sorry, I don't mean to be mean, but also... No, Dallas, don't worry. On the on the last episode that came out, I specifically had to go... So, uh, here's something we haven't seen in a minute. I don't get lost. Hmm, I wonder what I'm sending back. Skull Servant. I mean Jinsler, but Wait, was yeah. it? No, it was Jinzo, I'm sure. Oh, okay. Painful choice. Well, Jinzo was the right call. About it. Bring out several Skull Servants, do it! I mean, why not? I mean, it is, I mean it works. Uh, by the way, Axe, a nice misspelling of after. What do I give to... Okay, so Axe okay, is so. confirmed. D David is picking, okay. <laughs> Become <laughs> me! Like, like, why why oh, didn't why you did you hard yet, but... say it? Uh, You should definitely pick Skull Seren because it Axe, gets out of the gravy. Hey, the, the reason graveyard. I didn't say it is because okay. I don't have to learn to talk. So, Skull Seren in your graveyard times a thousand. Oh, he has to. He has to read oh, King of the Skull Servants. No, I've I've never seen. I, I, that's yeah, weird. I that's actually that's an off-meta oh, deck. Fun fact: that's part of a tournament deck later. Yeah. 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 White, right. Whites. Whites are actually whites. Uh, a relevant yeah. archetype. Well, arguably, yeah. it wasn't whites that were a relevant archetype. It's just the grass okay. is greener is broken. You have. Well, there's that too. I'm pretty sure you had a Skull Servant in hand. That is public yes. information. You know, he did. Yeah. Yes. yes. As public information. So I will send a second one to your hand and send the rest to your data. Okay, so what did he... So he needed a king, the, the third skull, mad dog, and Zombrira. The benefits of playing this type of deck Marth has... It... What is this? It's okay. one of my witches. Yeah, I kind of hear that. Let's see. I don't actually this is a good question. So we're talking they're talking very quietly off yeah. off mic in text that doesn't matter, but like Yeah. Cause David's picking. But like I find it funny they nobody reacted to Slifer like you said. I also don't think did anybody actually react when I showed that my desk had obel, my deck had obelisk in it? Okay. Eh, the no, other week? I mean honestly Loth, I'm gonna assume by the fact I assumed by the fact that you played infinite cards that you had a uh Slifer. Okay, that's uh, that's a fair assumption. Because yeah, like, infinite cards isn't in the Exodia deck. That's yeah, like when, when you play infinite cards, like hearing Slifer, I'm like, you know what? That makes sense. Like it, it's yeah. not it's not a fully wacky. Right. Yeah. We're doing an interesting I, tech I, thing here. I'm waiting for him to do it. Uh oh. You know what card you should? Oh have no, he's gonna deck. go the other way. Uh, well, uh, <laughs> oh, they're both doing it. You, you what? Know what deck card you should, might want to add to that deck? Uh, just as a fun alternate win combina uh, condition. Uh, it's silly, but blasting the ruins. Okay. Oh, jeez. I expected you to do that. I did run a Heart of the Underdog Blasting the Ruins deck once. It was fun. Blasting the Ruins is such a weird card. It isn't actually a win yet. Yes, it so, does. So, uh, I, I will say this. Uh, I, I know which card I'm definitely banning this week. Uh, is it Mystic Plasma Zone? Yes. It's time yeah. for Dark to end. Honestly, I'm okay with that. As someone that we has okay become we... the warrior of light. Wait, well, uh, I, I think it's wait. just because we've 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 existed in a space where like like banning molten destruction just fucks over Vesper those weeks. Yeah, in a row. I, I, was, I was gonna say my words is like molten destruction. I'm angry about because like fire is not good. Yeah, but it's dark is okay. good. We, well, like, we've yeah. reached a critical like, mass yes. of dark beats. I think. As I said, yeah. dark and wind are good. Like anyone well, hitting rising air current or mystic plasma zone. Has anyone played a wind see. deck yet? So nobody's wait, really on, tried. Is, is someone gonna... I tried once. So we're probably going to unban uh, molten destruction then. Molten yeah, destruction isn't banned. Never, that was never banned. Oh, it isn't. Okay, my bad. That was a joke. I, I thought the way we've never joke. banned a field spell. It's just that uh, because Axe is an animal, he always says every week, every single mm. time Vesper plays molten I destruction doing fire. It. That was a joke. Well, that's you because stop. Vesper stopped playing fire. But you said it every week, Axe. Just because other people repeat bad jokes doesn't mean you should. Okay. Hey, my jokes aren't bad. <laughs> Ban Harpy's Feather Duster, ban Dallas. I mean, Look, that just... blame the community. I, I do say, blame the community now. But also, I also thank Vesper. I also thank Vesper for being your friend. <laughs> Dallas is pointing to the stands like, you made me this way. <laughs> I've only become what you created. Okay. Wow, we are just doing all kinds of fucking trades and searches and holy shit. Oh, yeah, I don't know what's happening right you, now. Whose turn is it? It is You're still my turn. Like, uh, yes. Well, this is oh, the David's finals. I'm glad. I, on the one hand, there's nothing to comment about this just the second, 
because just, we're going back and forth so fast. But on the other hand, I'm glad shit's happening. I, you know, yeah, I'm glad. looking at... Oh, sorry. You're you're right, door, yeah. first. Looking at the art for Fiend Makers, I've always thought it's some kind of weird mechanical horse thing, but now I look at it closely, it's like, wait, is that just a... A shoulder, shoulder shot of a man in gold armor. I no, thought that was a weird. Oh, there's a face there. Hold yeah, this is just. Time, I thought it was a weird mechanical. This horse. is just weird, edgy Buster Blader. He's a warrior, Honestly, by the way. Yeah. This is Buster Blader with a spike chain. Look, it's, I don't, I don't trust Yu-Gi-Oh. A horse can be a warrior. Yeah, no, I, I'm, gonna warrior. Give Law, I'm gonna give Law full credit on that. That's, that's fair. Fair, fair enough. Oh, uh, types are bullshit. Here's, here's apparently a. a, a... A garage kit or figure of him or a 3D model of him or something? I don't know. Oh my god, uh, somebody probably did Delisa this? Of the Roses. That's definitely Delisa of the Roses. That makes sense, yeah. Look at his dumb yeah, chin that, face. That, yeah, but considering, oh, like, for the longest glory, time, yeah. the card art just has, like, if I'm, like, the waist up or it something. It is a weird profile. Yep, and then he's yeah. just gonna crack the door and pop it's a, very weird, yeah, it's a very weird angle. Like, well, yeah. that's, that's just Jim One Lutzers in general. Yeah. People, oh, no. will people will complain oh. about generic anime same face shit these days, but uh, at, the at the very least, we have a lot more like detail and perspective in cards. Well, by the way, I, I I forgot mm. to say this earlier, but for the audience at home, uh, yeah, my deck got a shit kicked in, but it's better than the other deck idea I had because more uh, Pikachu and Kuren cards came out this week. Uh, I, I will say, I, mean, I yeah, God, I think God, okay. someone dissuaded you from that. Yeah, no, there are in fact there are in fact three Dark Nineteen Hundos. Uh, I will say this. Um, at least, uh, like, at least the finals is not a blowout. Oh, no, yeah, this is a super competitive format, but I think we're all seeing things yeah. that are happening just now. Yeah, what, no. Boss Raider! Who patently competent yeah. at bring, uh, who, who, who just teared through everybody else. Yeah. You you thought Horus was the blowout deck, and it kind of is, but we we both, both Horus players got destroyed in semis. By I mean, Bunga what, what I will say is, if I do ban it, I have gone up from 6 to 8. Because six is uh, not as the man has multiple. Vesper, I'm gonna plead with you to ban a specific card, and I know you have it, but please, Dallas, don't. You can you. I'm not banning graceful charity until someone else does it. it does... Oh God, I'm not. I'm gonna go ban. People are animals. I'm gonna probably go ban Seth. We are. I mean, we know it's gonna get banned. Hold on, Dallas. I was gonna say this. You know what I'm banning because I got my ass kicked by it. <laughs> We, listen, this this has actually happened. Games, games. This has actually okay. happened in several yeah. formats, that where where we I'm think attacking. a card should be banned, yeah, I know. but because of the relationship we have with the first round, no, he's gotten all three skull that. servants in grave. Sadly, I'm mm -hmm. not sure if the audience picked that up, but uh, thank you, Ma, for giving us the sheep noises as you summoned your Yes, skateboard. he did. He did say sheeps and go. Marth Mar will be the next Altera the Sun. Woo! Raigeki Ooh. off the top. Where was that? Yeah, this is why Marth is in the Rai finals. The man top decks Raigeki. That's why he's here. Also, you, you're about to you're about to say that white kid and Luff get that. I, I heard it. I heard the L. So. No, so, no, I, I was gonna or I, I was gonna so, say me Rebecca, first. I, 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 no trap. People say I'm a lucky son of a bitch, but I think Marf is like twice. No, as you're lucky. just lucky when it comes to getting cards. Yeah, you're, you're lucky when it you. comes to getting cards. Fuck no, you. you are a you are the bougie capitalist um capital Idiot. gains fuck. You are me. Like, you, Axe, you, I'm gonna throw you into it. I'm gonna throw you into a bitch and set you on fire. You, you are a. A decent. By the way, uh, Marth TT, decent choice with Mamanga. You are the. Uh, you are the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh no, of me of and to it, that witch. That's the third chat? witch. I have yeah, David also has a shitload of witches. No, I, no, you, I make no, you know no, what? You uh, kind of are Chaz. You are kind of a trust fund kid. <sighs> <laughs> well, I mean, you are debating what what character you are. Chaz actually does get some wins in. He also spends mm. some time as a bad guy. He yeah, well, also writes like, really we, bad poetry. We, we, we did talk yeah. about how, how, how Misawa had a billion decks. Manjome probably did have the most actual decks he okay. played. So yes, he right, evolved the most, because he started playing a Thonic deck, which... He also he started, he also yeah, started playing a weird fire fire deck. Yeah, I'm just doing the crash. Gonna crash for some fire. They both have to activate their effects. Says, Fuck you, fire. Hold on, does a virus show up? It's just that Spider-Man pointing meme. Oh god, if I could draw, I would redraw that. Okay. Fuck, he just... The normal summons, they don't stop. That's a big dog. I think what we've learned is that no matter how many edgy oh, strategies we try, we'll just get beat. 
We're oh gonna crash God. again! <laughs> <laughs> we have to you it don't get that. Happening. But he's gonna draw a set and then win. I know it. Well, he's not. Uh, well, hey, I suppose if he just attacks with set, yeah. and I win. Yeah, I surrender. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you don't even let me do it. I'm well, he already knew he lost. Like, if you summoned any monster, it would have been over. Yeah. But okay, that was our finals. That was very back and forth. Yeah. That was almost a not quite a mirror match because it was chaos. That was the closest chaos, final we've had in a while. God yeah. damn, that was that was good. Yeah. I want to say that was way better than I watching that. I felt way better about that than how last week ended with a little bit of a blowout. My deck just didn't go versus Axe. I, I will never got so it's pretty spicy. Oh, skull servant. I, I will say yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. If any, I'm gonna, I'm gonna end the recording on this. Does anybody have any final comments about the duel? Well, good job, Mark, I wish you yeah, I good job, that. David. I did. Thank you. And that was those finals. It was terrible, but mine and Omega's finals with Mystic Shine Ball beats versus Aqua. It's <laughs> true. It was just silly. The actual okay, I'm gonna cut final it. we've had was, I believe, me versus Marth when I beat him by a hundred life points. Yeah. yeah, it was nice. All right, I'm. All right, we're going. Uh, okay. All right, so let me. Yeah, I still have the image open. So, uh, our first round, first loser is Vispir. So, uh, I know you were thinking about it. What card have you decided to ban, which cannot be unbanned this week? I think. As much as Horus isn't. As much, as much as Horus didn't actually do much in this tournament, uh, against my game in particular, <laughs> level 8 just fucked me over because I had Feather Duster Rhoda in my hand. Uh, I'll ban level 8 because... Right. Well, I was just going to stick level 6. Level 6 is nowhere near as actually a uh, part of a card to out as it seemed to be for me. As, as you saw by the fact that Dallas threw multiple level 6s on the field and got punched every time in his second match. Yeah. But if you can eight out, and that just sits there, uh, no spells kind of hurts us right now when we're in a very spell-reliant format. Okay, so I need to find H in here. H-I. Horus, the bolt. Not an E in there. The Black Flame Dragon <laughs> level uh, yes. eight. Oh, yes. Horus. Horus. <laughs> okay. Horus. So, uh, <laughs> moving, moving swiftly on from that, <laughs> Axe, you are our second... Game first loser. What yeah, card? Dragon. Okay, he's doing it. All right. Yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> a lot of like, all right. Choice. I mean, I'm not. I, it's I, it's I'm axe. I'm gonna reiterate. I think you people are all animals. Well, we, we are. Play Crystal Charity. And it didn't actually. All right. Well. Okay. So said said now finally has turn. eaten a ban list, and now it is Loth's turn. You are our last first loser. You know, be. I know L. Oh, everyone knows what I'm gonna ban. Clearly, it's uh, Graceful Charity. Oh, thank God. Okay, oh, Graceful Charity, locking it in. Oh, all right. Cause you, know, I know and for a fact I'm gonna God. fucking lose next week anyway. So I'm gonna just gonna ban <laughs> Mystic Plasma Zone next week. All he'll right. wait. He'll okay. he'll wait until after the redo. Okay, so our new bans, which cannot be removed from the list, are Sed, uh, Graceful Charity, and Horus the Black Flame Dragon level eight. So, uh, now for the sake of the audience at home, because this is only two and a half minutes, I'm going to cut the recording and then immediately restart it so that we can discuss unbanning because it is week 15. And audience at home, if it takes us another 30 minutes, you'll know because I'm going to comically speed it up to about four, eight times speed uh, and, and see what will. that's like. <laughs> and if it's not, <laughs> we'll speak like normal people. So, uh, we will be right back -ish. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh we're back. So obviously, there's no pressure to to be slow. Yeah. Because I'll fast like, forward. I, I I know I got uh, kicked by Mystic Plasma Zone, but I, I as I thought about it, Graceful Charity is a pretty powerful card, and I also don't have any copies of it, so I'm like, fuck it. Oh no! It. I totally understand it keep being banned. I'm. I was just surprised you like you should you should have smokescreened us with the with the joke. Yeah. You oh, got yeah. in. You got in there. You switched. But okay, so now that we've already wasted 30 seconds of our time, all right. Yeah. So I've discussed this before. I don't think we should do necessarily like we did last time and do a literal line by line, but um, mm -hmm. I've talked about this. I want a big slaughter of this ban list. There Shit needs to come back. 
There are literally mm-hmm. only two cards I want to stay on the ban list. Cyberjar for one. Cyberjar and Pot of Cyber Jar, Jar, def- gotta... Cyber Jar will never come off. But, like, I have arguments for almost all of these. So... Do we do we have any strong contenders for cards that aren't named Pot of Greed or Cyber Jar or Delinquent Duo? That's another one that well, I'm the thinking about. To uh, chaos. Magician of Faith. Oh, you so want Magician of Faith to stay on? No, so I want it to come back. I so mean, all judgment should come back. Yeah, no, 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 no. no don't don't make arguments for shit to come back. Make arguments for shit to stay. Because uh, if you don't right, say that a card should I want should chaos to stay, man. well, it can't I, come off. I, we just I, said that. As much as as much okay. as uh, it shoots, no, he said chaos sorcerer. But as much as it shoots my deck in the foot, uh, or my myself in the foot, because I'm one of the two people that own it, I think change of heart needs to stay if magician is coming off. No, that's well, change of heart's a very yeah. strong one. Yeah, that's a power card that's been banned well, for a long time. Have it too, so yeah. Like, yeah, it's not fair, but he didn't it's it's right. monster control is pretty brutal anyway, but change of heart is the most Th- unbalanced no one. If, yeah. if nobody right. else is strong about this, I'll get in conceit. I don't want people coming back because in in in, in, in indestructible monsters are just a pain in the ass to deal with and slow us down. To I it. would yeah. like it to come back because it stops what just happened this week. Yeah. It does. But I don't, man. Like, Besides, don't you? Have oh, I mean, it's it's it's. Out, don't you have the card? I, I have been beat down to, to death to too color. often. Well, I've got I've got the perfect solution, Dallas. We can let him have Spirit Reaper. Dark Hole comes off. That doesn't help me. I don't own Dark Hole. You don't? How do you not own Dark Holes? Oh no, wait. I do own Dark Holes. Never okay, mind. all right. I'm about to Damn say. Damn it, Dallas. Hey, keep Dark Hole on. Keep. But I, I, I own Dark Holes. I would I prefer. Spirit I hope to God people own more own Dark Hole at least one of I rather than Regeki. I, I do not own Dark Hole. Because also Spirit Reaper what? is the the thing with Spirit Reaper is it it like like because I'll, I'll I'll raise you one, uh, Vesper. I think Spirit Reaper can come back. You know what card I don't think should come back? Uh, Gravity Bind. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, yeah. No. yeah, no, that's... that's. I yeah. mean, like, on the one hand, as much as I want stuff to come up, I'm okay with level limit and gravity mind staying No, down I there. want level limit to come off, because it's a lot easier to deal with. I mean, yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, I'll talk... I'll, mm-hmm. Hey, I, I, I won with that level limit area ocean deck. I'll let level limit come off. I would like level limit to stay, but... Okay, okay, well, so I, we, I we've we got know. some... Okay, well, let's let's lock thing. into our I arguments mean, for shit we know can absolutely come back, right? Yeah. Uh, let's see. So, so let's see... Much? Uh, no. Yeah, fairy box. Fairy box should come back. Uh, should we? Yeah, fairy box should come back. Yeah. Everybody's fine. I'll, I'll let it go. I, I don't think come back, but everybody's fine with it. I'm fine with it. Can't call I mean, we've got just back. as many dog shit battle traps that are a pain in the butt. If it's yeah. really annoying, well, I don't actually but know if anybody's gonna run fairy it's box. It's kind of but the like... same thing about gravity bind and level limit area B. It's like, are we gonna ban all of those cards? Because well, then that's that's why um a next obvious one, thunder of ruler, needs to come off. We have. Yeah. Thunder, we have, we a, have a better war. one. Yeah, so yeah, we, we can just remove that. that yeah. Yeah. Well, I think the reason we banned uh, Thunder of Ruler initially was because don't say like, we, you don't say we, David. Yeah, you banned it because you, you got you got blasted yeah. one week. Come on, yeah, but and that yeah. was because it when it went during the standby phase. Yeah. <laughs> Which I think um, most. I mean, but that's the that's the thing. Um, threatening roar activates whenever you feel like it. So no, no, when, no, when he banned uh, Thunder of Ruler, it made sense. Yes, it doesn't make There's sense. Really now bad. it needs to okay. to to yeah, because we've got a better one. Okay. Um, okay. No, other that's... than the fact that Axe is still butthurt about Chaos, does anybody else care about Chaos Sorcerer? No. 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 Not really. Yeah. No, it's because I just know David's gonna play it. It's just, uh, okay. well, then you should. That's not yeah. about the meta, Axe. Okay. Hey, God, I, I hope guess what? I'm also gonna build the Chaos deck, and what you know what you can okay. do about it? Nothing. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. Okay. So let's see. I want. I mean, the the person in the format who has no chaos sorcerer is finally coming back. I don't care. It, it'll it'll fuck me over. I'm sure. Oh, yeah. Guess what? I chaos sorcerer is with... a common. We all have chaos sorcerers. Yeah, I'm I do actually. Like, oh. With both now with said band, I actually do think BLS is still a little too spicy. If you can yeah, actually drop yeah, him, yeah. he's he's yeah. really brutal. I don't know if he can come off yet. I just don't know if anybody else in the game uh, is that good as a boss monster. Yeah. Fair. Yeah. Uh, for, let's for, see. for how like, relatively easy it about... is to get ELS. Yeah. Like oh, I, 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 I wouldn't I wouldn't be upset if the two chaos boss monsters have to sit the next five weeks out. Yeah, no, that's hey, uh that's... I'm fine with Call of the Haunted coming off. So yeah, I'm on call. call. Do we because there's premature. Yeah, we, there, we still have so... premature. 
I mean, I'm going to make a case for Monster Reborn to, to as well come off just for the heck of it. Like, I but is well. Call, call is the off. slowest of all of those. I think Call should I'm come sorry. off. Do yeah, we have any strong objections? I, haunted. I have to post this one again. He's got to post Call of the Loth, right? But does anybody have any strong objections about Call? <laughs> Damn it. No. I don't. No. Okay. As much as it annoys me that these cards are coming off, it's like, because I own none of them, I, I can't make a good argument for it. Like I said, the only... What, does anyone have strong things about Chain Energy? I, uh, Chain I Energy was an early meme energy. ban. L listen, I, as the guy who did it, I don't think you can expect me to come back and do it. Yeah. If yeah. you if you play Chain Energy, you're a fuckhead. But there's way yeah, better there's way better cards than Chain Energy that do Chain yeah. Energy in it now. Yeah. If you open three Chain Energy, it's really funny. But that's the only Max, time it'll. Uh, are, you, are, you, are you having an issue today? Because he never ran Chain Energy. The problem is that he wasn't in the game. He wasn't. In the it wasn't in the format when it was played. I was. Oh, you have. How did you? Wow, Vesper. So you were the one person who got blown out. I only just now tabbed over. You were the one person who got blown out and got no Sork. Yeah, well, that's why I keep talking about it. I don't have oh. it. Wow. Um, you I'm want pretty one? sure between you all of us, we should actually. have. Like, we can. We can work on that. Anyway, so okay. chain, chain energy. Actually, I got four now, thanks to Dark Revelations too. So we can probably work on that if we just want to make sure. But yeah. uh, so chain energy. We were okay. I, um, Okay. Don't yeah, like, but eh. it's a terrible card. I hate it, but it's not gonna do anything unless someone plays yeah. the deck. Okay, so uh, Curse Seal of Forbidden Spell. I said we weren't gonna do this in alphabetical, but it's the only way I'm gonna get any organization out of you guys. So Curse Seal. Yeah. yeah. Should it? Uh, should I'm, it? I'm it, really it should stay on. Wow. This was banned last time. Yeah, I actually kind of agree with that. It was okay, banned. But it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't banned. fucking matter. I have Magic Drain. I, it's still been banned for only a week. Yeah. Uh, if all set fucks up a polarization deck, so uh, I said No it doesn't. I have Miracle Fusion. And Dragon's Mirror. Yeah, we, well, we are say, starting I'll to get the this, ultimate this, polarization this, around. And power bond. Oh, I, I just, I'm still saying should keep on. Okay, okay. Several this. people several I, people have objected it to it coming off. That's fine. I still run Magic yeah. Train. It's fine. It doesn't do anything. I'll say I'll say in regards to Magic Drain, Curse Seal, the second part of that uh, effect is pretty brutal as opposed to Magic Drain. I mean, it's it's true. It's still, that said, like, I actually think that Curse Seal is in a lot of ways a worse card. You have you have to have a spell card to discard. But I, yeah. I get that it's more annoying to play against if it actually procs. So we can leave it on. Dark Hole's coming off. Yeah. We all said that earlier. Yeah. Yeah. If people don't have Dark Holes, maybe we should trade some. Maybe. Yeah, I don't have Dark Hole. I've uh, only got a singular Dark Hole. Gravity Bind stays on, obviously. Graceful Charity stays on. Okay, we got another one that may be controversial. How do people feel about Order? We did just put uh, Horus the Black Flame Dragon level 8 on. Yeah, if we're going to ban uh, Horus, I think it should stay banned. Also, yeah. too many people have it. It's true. <laughs> I have two. I have fucking two yeah. Orders. I could be an Order dealer. Too many dealer. people have Imperial Order. So, I think I have two... It's well. it's spicy. Let's leave order off for a little bit. Maybe later. We'll, we'll get a feel for it. Leave level yeah. limit on. I, I I I think it does stand to reason that that uh, I guess a decent handful of these cards are we're keeping banned either because they just fuck with our weird format or because they're already banned cards. Yes. Right, so yeah. Axe, I think I stole your luck for this week. Okay, but Mar Marth still has an objection to level limit area B. Anybody else? Any other takers on that staying on? Uh, let me double check. Level like, I kind of want it to come off, like I said. I could totally oh. switch back to my winning ocean deck, but... I just think well, the... one of them should come off. Well, here's the thing. Oh. I'm just, like, I'm just ambivalent. Okay, well, I'm if he's ambivalent, then it should it should come off. Nobody yeah. cares. I'm fine yeah. with it coming off, because you know what this means? It's stumbling for level four higher monsters. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, oh, I've so I've been talking about this, right, with with the, the stuff. I I want Moth to come off. I, I know more people own oh, no, multiples, but, like, I like being able to get shit back from the graveyard. Look, can we take off Reborn and Vindictive? Or no? if, graceful with... charity, if Graceful Charity and Pot and Change of Heart stay banned, I'm fine with Moth coming yeah, off. We've already yeah. Said yeah, those have, the, we've already say... passed them, so... I w yeah. Did we, did we take... No, Monster Reborn's still on here. Monster Reborn we haven't discussed yet. I I, yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna say, I would say, I mean, in my opinion, we should bring back only one of Moth yeah. or Monster Reborn. But I only Axe owns here's Monster why. Reborn. Here, here's why. Uh, first of all, only one person owns Monster Reborn, and second of all, it's not that easy to loop uh, moth, it's really not. It's not. Yeah. Wait, only one person who wants to be born. Or are are you admitting you own a monster reborn? Or are you making a, a very hard, subtle please, jab about Axe? No, no, I have monster reborn. It's an ultra rare from Legend of Blue Eyes. No, two people do. Wow, I, I really? 
You never ever fucking played it. No, he did. No, he did every no, week I, until. I, I, no, remember the week ago banned, I played it. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm still whatever. I don't. I. It, it, they can both come back. Yeah. I'm just before I delete them. I want to know if people are gonna yell at me as you're watching me I'm, delete things. No, I'm. I'm no. a little bit. I'm a little bit mad on either, so I, I don't really okay. care. Uh, yeah. uh, Old vindictive. A card I had banned. Uh, I mean, let's see here. It, so obviously, I mean, we brought Moth back. So Apprentice Magician is already spicy. But at yeah. the same time, we have run into a problem where we're getting a lot of monsters who we're are very... We're getting decks that are destroying everything. And we're getting a lot yeah. of boss monsters who are like... Obviously, Horus just got banned, but he's not going to stay banned forever. And there are other monsters like that who are starting to get... We're starting to get setups where it's getting harder to play spell and trap removal on monsters. So I wouldn't yeah. mind unbanning Vindictive to be like... Yeah, yeah we have alternatives. Especially if... I'm going to make a wild assumption here. We're getting Pitch Black Warwolf back, I'm assuming. Probably. Probably, yeah. I mean, oh, we, so Mirage Dragon's been in the format for like two or three weeks and nobody's had yet felt yeah, like banning him. It's, to be fair, Mirage Dragon's not as powerful as like Pitch Black Warwolf because then Pitch Black Warwolf, I know it fucked me up, but it gets rid of Sack, it gets rid of like Matt. No, Matt Ma 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 uh, Mirage Dragon Loth is literally Pitch Black Warwolf, the, but light and a dragon. It's just one is light. Yeah. The oh, only okay. difference is that Warwolf is a dark type. Oh, I remember now. Better. That's because you played a dark deck against me. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, on the one hand, Warwolf. listen, Warwolf. I mean, hey, Loth, you should have, if you were upset about Dark Beats, you should have actually banned Mystic Plasma Zone. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, no, no, I'm banning it next week because everyone knows I'm going to lose. I mean, oh, don't say God. that yet. Okay, but anyway, so so it sounds like we're all okay with, with both Old Vindictive and Warwolf coming off. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be interesting how that goes. Oh god. Okay. Um, it, it's. I mean, like, honestly, we have so much. We have so much destruction that targets. We have Sack and Rageki break. Why so do you want to? Not uh, that issue. Yeah, Ring of Destruction hurts both people. I think it's actually more fair than some cards we have in this format. So. Yeah. It is a worse card than Smashing Ground. So yeah, I think it's okay. Um, Vesper, stop playing fire. I don't think we should keep Solar Fair Dragon on here. I mean, I I, 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 my problem with it is that it, it creates a lock. But, the, but the, uh, I'll, I'll say this, David. There are four cards in our format that create the same lock. I'm about yeah. to create this. Command Knight. I think, I think the only reason that, like, Command Knight hasn't been slapped is because... It's slower. I mean, but in that case, then no Command Knight can get slapped yet, when it gets slapped. Yeah. Like, I mean, also, Dar I Dark Hole just came back. Raigeki is legal. Old Vind There's a lot of ways to out yeah, the lock there, now. There are ways to out out locks like. Also, that, I'm just gonna remove Stalin Judgment. I don't think anybody gives a shit. Yeah, I yeah, don't no. give a shit. Might give off an edge. So, uh, yes. Yeah, I think totally. the only Spirit Reaper seems a little controversial. Do we want to make I, him sit out the next five okay, weeks? Well, my, my question is, my question for Spirit Reaper is, where are we sitting on Gravity Bind and Level Limit? Because I don't think Level all Limit came of off. should stay back. Level Limit came off. We are okay, already deleted I think from Spirit the list. Spirit Reaper should stay on. Ooh, Marth says he wants to stay it on. I want it to come off, but I'm... It's more me. of... If I'm, 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 also uh, on cards. I'm also ambivalent yeah. about it, because, eh. I don't know. I, I think the, Okay. We have so many. I, I think we're starting to get more destruction, especially. I mean, yeah, we have we have unbanned a lot of removal. I think but, it might be better to let him come back now. Yeah. 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 Besides, if you there's a specific thing you can get him just locked in attack mode, you can just attack him over and over again. It is true. In our next set, that. level limit area A comes out, so you can yeah. force him to be in attack mode, which is fun. Yeah. I think we also have a trap card that forces face no, up. That's cards. the card. Yeah, that, that is level limit area A. That's That should be an element of energy. All three and lower monsters are forced into attack Actually, mode. no, I think there was one before that. Was there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, there's yeah. Battle Mania. That's just all monsters have to be in attack yeah. position. Bit, bit of an aside. Not Battle Mania. Like um, final attack orders. Go ahead, that was final attack orders. That is, in fact, what I said. So. Loth, you're trying to say anything? Oh, yeah, no, no. I was selling Dallas about yeah. the DM I sent him. We're talk we're okay, talk well, 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 let's 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 get Spirit Reaver off. Yeah. Uh, I don't think, does anybody object to Stealth Bird? I no. have one thing to say. Oh, Fuck really? you, Stealth Bird. That is all. <laughs> okay, I, I but, so fine. we can flip him the bird, but should we take him off the ban list? But I'm fine with it. Flip the flip yeah. bird the bird, but let him come off. Okay. Um, so I think this is our last really spicy call. Restrict. Uh, this is a tech card a lot of people I, have access to. I really don't want it. I don't want to deal with it. I think it should come with off, but small, I want 
I think another card should be hit instead because the problem oh. card is still in the format. Metamorphosis? No, the pro metamorphosis isn't a problem. With no, it's, it's magical it's... scientist. Yeah, yeah I, I, don't, I don't see how magical scientist, which costs me a thousand life points, is is as the only man who actually oh. plays magic scientist. I don't think he's I as bad as uh, metamorphosis. I, I like to, I like to posit an idea, which is. Magical scientist without a uh, thousand eyes restrict on the field. You can't really get too much of worth note. So if we keep my thousand eyes restrict on the banners for a little while longer, if you can't just be like magical scientist thousand eyes restrict. I mean, yeah, it's a removal tool okay. as that combo. I mean, I, I mean, I could be persuaded to keep it on there. I just. It, it like sounds like a lot of people eventually. still think that just because yeah, he's because yeah, no, nobody's played metamorphosis uh, scapegoats yet, but you can. Yeah, I'm not saying it should stay on it definitely. Okay. You don't want it ever off the ban list? I don't. Why? It's a uh, shitty card. But okay, it, I, I'll, I'll, I'll. Okay. Anybody with like, Scapegoats could access it. Okay. But I know. I know. No, not everyone has it. But Scapegoat Metamorphosis is is the way to do it. It's. I, and we're magical scientists, and we have all those other cards in the. I mean, I, so, I'm f I'm fine leaving it on for five I, more I'm weeks not, and see if yeah. magical scientist gets got or if metamorphosis gets got I, in those I'm intervening fine weeks. I'm leaving it on there forever. I'm definitely. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I like honestly, especially once retrains, which are better, come back. I do think he can come off. The problem is yeah. that if we if we do never hit metamorph or magical scientist. But, uh, and to be fair, I do actually think it's more likely that those cards will eventually get got. There will eventually they, be they will. monsters that are not okay. Yes, um, that, that, that's what I was positing, that it will eventually come off, yeah, but for now, yeah. we should keep it on. Okay. Yeah, I'm not saying keep it on forever. I'm saying one minute orbs is Magical Scientist and Scapegoat are still in the format. Those three cards are just the way to do it. Honestly, I think Scapegoat should be hit before I think uh, Thousand Eyes should be hit, but that's a different yeah. conversation. Well, well, well that's, yeah, oh, that's but, a conversation I have later. Scapegoat is not hit. Hits, if we hit uh, scapegoat, we don't get to hear Moth going back. Uh, well, no, uh, scapegoat should be hit at what pack is it? <laughs> uh, what there, there's a specific pack scapegoat should be hit before we get to. Uh, well, we'll discuss uh, that Genesis. later. We'll, yeah. we'll discuss that later. Okay, so the last two, I don't, I don't think I care. I, we've got so much spell trap stuff. N neither Harpy's Feather Duster or Heavy Storm got banned this week. I think Wave Motion can come out. We people have dust tornadoes. They have MSTs. They have Regeki breaks. We, we have so much more access to from yeah. I'm fine with yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, and like honestly, even if I think Marth is the only one with a vampire alert, also again, I I want to see him try Genesis. I don't, I don't even know why that card got banned. Uh, uh, I think David got is... Vampire Lord looped a little bit because oh, it was hard yeah, to get rid. Yeah. It was actually hard to deal with a few weeks Here, ago. Here's the thing: Nephthys is a better card and scarier, so I don't know why Vampire Lord should be. All right, yeah. so let's let's uh, let's hack it off. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. By the way, Dallas, I was correct. Last time we talked about bands, I said, "Hey, don't worry, just give it a just give it a week or five." You you did in fact say that it off. would come back next time, and yeah. I was like, "I'm pretty sure you will." So right now, going into week sixteen, Elemental Energy, the only cards which are banned will be Blackluster Soldier Envoy of the Beginning, Change of Heart, Chaos Emperor Dragon Envoy of the End, Curse Seal of Forbidden Spell, Cyber Jar, Delinquent Duo, Gravity Bind, Graceful Charity, Horus the Black Flame Dragon Level Eight, Imperial Order, Pot of Greed, Thousand Eyes Restrict. Yeah, that sounds like a fair ban list. So yeah. uh, alright yeah. folks, let's uh go have some fun and open some packs. So uh yeah. everybody say goodbye to the internet. Bye, Internet. Bye, Internet. Bye, Internet. Bye, Internet. Bye, Internet. Bye, Internet. So, uh...